Hello fellow grads, I'm Irefo Popajuman and I'm proud to be graduating with an arts degree in sociology. Each one of us has a story that led us here today. Mine began in West Africa and Ghana. I was a month shy of my 14th birthday when my parents brought me and my two younger brothers to Canada. It was a leap of faith. They wanted to give us more opportunities than we had back home and I always knew I wanted to go to university. I was actually still a high school student when I first came to campus. I was a mentor for an outreach program for school-aged kids called Can You? So I already knew my way around here long before I was actually a university student. My time at the University of Manitoba has been so special. This is where I fell in love with international relations. It's also where I learned more about Indigenous peoples and their rights. And it's where I would have these deep conversations about race and gender injustice. It's also where I started making connections about how we interact as a society and what that looked like in my own life and also in world events happening around me. Our University of Manitoba journey is made up of so many memories and is so much more than the pandemic challenges of this past year. For me, when I look back, I think about studying on the second floor of the Defoe Library, one of my favorite spots. All of us students were working on different studies, but somehow you never felt alone there. I also think about the hustle and bustle of the UMSU University Center, which I loved, and all the amazing volunteer opportunities on campus. I continue to volunteer with Kanye throughout university and we see how some of the kids I mentored have become mentors themselves. That was a full circle moment for me and it was amazing. But I feel more than anything today on what is a super surreal day is gratitude. I'm so grateful for the opportunities I've had and for my family and friends who have been a big support through it all. So even though all of us 2021 graduates may not physically be together, I like to think we're together in spirit, cheering each other on. We did it. This time last year, I would never have believed that today we'd still be in the pandemic. One of the greatest joys of being Chancellor is meeting with students, but unfortunately this has not been possible. I miss seeing your happy, beautiful faces today. It's a time of huge societal disruption and personal learning, but life continues on. You have persevered and are graduating. This is truly a cause for celebration. One day this spring, I found myself inexplicably sobbing. I came to see this as pandemic emotions I needed to release. I found myself thinking of you especially when the weight of the pandemic got to me. I thought of how much more energy you had to muster to complete your final year. I've also thought about the extraordinary efforts of our faculty and staff to make this year possible. And I've been very conscious of everyone's well-being. You have reached deep within yourselves to get to this day. You have also likely reached out to others, both to lend support and to receive it. We've all become more aware of how important it is to look out for each other. Let us be forgiving and compassionate to ourselves and to everyone we meet. This pandemic will leave many legacies. May one of them be more kindness. Be proud of yourselves. You are extraordinary students forged during extraordinary times. Never ever forget this. Congratulations, Mamuth Takusawin, Gegi Mino Jigam, Wash Te Tonka, Felicitation. Congratulations, class of 2021. You are among UM's most distinct graduating classes. Never before has a class graduated from our university having completed most of their final year in a virtual format. You have faced challenges that none of us ever envisioned. In spite of this, you persevered through your final year amid upheaval in every aspect of your life. Who would blame you if you saw all this as a setback? Yet by choosing to not allow the pandemic to slow you down, you have inspired those around you perhaps more than you know. We know this wasn't easy. So many of you have demonstrated leadership beyond the classroom. You stepped up to help solve community challenges and used your voices to influence government decisions and policy. 
every graduating class is told that they have the opportunity to lead our society forward. But this has never been truer than it is for you. This pandemic made us pause and reevaluate virtually everything. And now we are poised to emerge into something new, something unknown. The world as we know it is changing before our very eyes and you have an opportunity to shape this new world with your sense of global justice, your ideas and passions. If this year has taught us anything, it is the power of personal and social responsibility. We are an interconnected world and have a responsibility to care for each other. Thank you for your incredible resilience. Thank you for all you will be doing going forward. Remember that your university is always here for you as you go forward to help shape a better world. We are so very proud of you. Growing up, I always had my head buried in a book. Nancy Drew was one of my favorite fictional characters because she was always solving a mystery. Even though I was a bookworm and really shy, I was never afraid. And I always made a point of trying new things out of my comfort zone. In university, in my first year, I decided to run in the elections for the Arts and Body Council. I still remember calling my mom right after and telling her that I had won. I couldn't believe it. It was a giant moment that I always cherish. By my fourth year, I had become president of the Arts and Body Council and I got the opportunity to advocate for students within my faculty. For all of us, this past year has taught us a lot. For me, it was realizing how extremely important mental health is and to never underestimate the power of human connection. The pandemic also revealed a lot of social inequalities we've been ignoring for far too long. And I want to work to be a part of that solution. I've always wanted to be a human rights lawyer. And one day, I hope to work to protect the rights of vulnerable populations. As graduates, each one of us has a goal. We each have our own dream. My challenge to you is to not only get there, but along the way, look out for one another. We're all in this together. Enjoy your moment. Congratulations. I now have the honor to ask, in the name of the University Senate, the Chancellor and Mann formally confer the degrees and diplomas earned by the graduates as they have been earned by each of them. By virtue of the authority vested in me as Chancellor of this University, I admit you to the degrees and diplomas to which you are severally entitled, with all the rights and privileges thereto appertaining. I also admit in absentia those who have completed the requirements for these degrees and diplomas, but who are not today able to be present.
Congratulations, graduates. I'm Kelly Main, Acting Dean of the Faculty of Graduate Studies. On this graduation day, I would like to extend my warmest congratulations to each of you on this accomplishment. Your graduate degree represents the culmination of years of hard work and sacrifice as you navigated through your degree requirements to get to this day. Congratulations on your well-deserved success. I hope you take the time to celebrate achieving your goals we are proud to welcome you into a new phase of your journey as an alumni of the University of Manitoba. Today is the first of many proud and successful days ahead. Congratulations again. Congratulations to the graduates of our degree, diploma and graduate degree programs. You did it. Well done. You're now set to enter one of the world's most vital professions, one that's engaged with food, human health, business and science and you are well prepared for the opportunities and challenges of that profession. And speaking of challenges, in light of last year's unusual academic year, you have every reason to be especially proud of your accomplishments. You showed adaptability, perseverance and strength, all qualities that will be important to you as you move on to the next stage of your life. You, the class of 2021, will play a key role in a new and different world, but one where food and health, let's not forget the agricultural connection between the two of them, these are going to assume new prominence in the minds of Canadians. So you leave the faculty with their best wishes as you put your talents and training to the creation of a more resilient future for Canada's food system. All the very best to you in your future endeavours, and don't be afraid to check back with us and let us know how you're doing. Congratulations once again. Hi, I'm Michelle Rogalski, Director of the School of Agriculture. I'm here in the Richardson Auditorium in the Agriculture Building at the University of Manitoba campus. I'm here to bring greetings to the 2021 class from the Diploma in Agriculture program. It seems really appropriate to be here in this venue. This is the place where you, as graduates, first became Aggies. This is where we hosted your orientation. This is where you spent many hours in classes. This is where you developed friendships and where you develop professional relationships, strong relationships with instructors and industry leaders. This room also has some historic significance. You are the 114th graduating class from the Diploma in Agriculture program. Like the classes before you, many hours were spent in this room. Some graduating classes even had this as the venue for their ceremony. Each year we host reunions of graduating classes who come back and share their memories and rekindle their friendships. I hope that we're gonna have the opportunity to reconvene in this room and meet again face to face. It's been a challenge with this pandemic, but as a class, you've done amazingly well adjusting to the challenges. I know that many of you are gonna be coming back to do your degree and will be spending time in this room. The school will be hosting the Manitoba Agronomist Conference again in the future, and many of you will come back um, to attend that conference as professional and technical agrologists. But most of all, I hope that we have the opportunity to come back and host you, the graduating class, for a reunion in the near future. But until then, we're going to have to continue connecting virtually. 
I look forward to this evening when we're going to celebrate with your family, friends, and the ag community at our virtual celebration. Until then, congratulations, class of 2021. The school is proud of you. Faculty of Graduate Studies. Teresa Oluwatosin Adesonia. Udwak Edit. Udari Madushani Wanigasekara Rajakaruna Wanigasekara Mudian Selage. Xiao O Ren. Katrina Cachero. Yan Hong Chen. Justine Emily Jean Cornelson. Lang Gong. Matthew Joseph Granger. Gina Elizabeth Campbell Karam. Ramandeep Kaur. Ramandeep Kaur. Shang Nan Li. Jessica Lynn Nixie. Nathaniel Wesley Waldy Ort. Rosanna Nancy Punko. Mohammed Shadeen. Alexander Braden Schumalak. Ankita Topper. Rahul Tripathi. Faculty of Agricultural and Food Sciences. Amanpreet Bawa. Luke Curtis Bossett. Janae Lynn Buchanan. Simon Cutler. Ruth Catherine Enns. Brian James Clausen. Chong Won Lee. Eric William Popoff. Sonia Margaret Rempel. Gabriela Fernanda Salcido Bune. Yi Shen. Diana Stakova. Emily Rosalind Bouvier. Ecoria Chan. J. 
Cine du cine ke. Riley and Duma. Michelle Falk. Janine Elizabeth Ingrid Hansen. Rebecca Marion McCleary. Thin Fook Win. Samantha Rochelle Nixon. Mihak Deep Singh. Abby May Delaney Taves. Jia Yi Chen. Auntie Dang. Chidiogo Karen Eze Christopher. Kiranjot Kaur. Jen Zhao Li. Yong Chao Liu. Finley John Makala. Mayhawk Mayhawk. Push up deep sing Sandu. Jong Yang Wan. Su Hao In. Lauren Elizabeth Gillingham Bellows. Paige Elizabeth Irene Chartrand. David Brian Chachanov. Denise Kadisha Daly. Nazari Stefan Demkowitz. Catherine Lawrence de Rocher. Nural Huda Ela Gailey. Ying Shren Fan. Tasnima Ferdas. Madeline Grace Ann Gilfix. Razia Gurbani. Kamaria Haroon. Chelsea Lynn Johnson. Callista Ann Cocott. Kate Ivy Heather Latexier. Wei La Wei Tian Li. Mylène Antoinette Maguet. Alexandra Marie Martins.
Madison Nicole McLeod. Dhruv Rajesh Mehta. Jody Ng. Judith Ekpenmoika Oviosun. Melissa Adrian Chahung Pearson. Avery Leanne Penner. Chantel Cleese Avril Pershot. Raina Marie Joy Powell. Annika Seven M. Carante. Shin Run Ren. Samantha Lynn Robinson. Haley Jolene Sherko. Beverly Joan St. Croix. Hanny Keith Chodosho. Tina Bit Tao Tran. McKenna Lynn Wojtowicz. Yuan Yi Zhang. Raya Zerko. School of Agriculture. Jordan Adeline Bilodeau. Johannes Cornelis Bokorst. Mackenzie Booker. Jenna Lee Bruce. Joran Dean Buchanan. Brendan Chornoboy. Dominic Gilles Joseph de Requigny. Joshua Darian George Drieger. Cassidy Judith Helen Drieger. Jed Timothy Terence Erb. Alex Gerer. Gracie Jane Gulak. Tasia Helgards. Vincent James Hughes. Peyton Brianne Janke. Aaron Mackenzie Kathler. Melvin Gary Kaufman. Carter Kevin Keel. Paul Kovacs. K. 
Kate Leanne Lepke. George James Megason. David Mackenzie Hannison Moser. Kathleen Rosalia Helen Ostertag. Spencer James Parker. Liane Alice Therese Rouir. Haley Nicole Rubenick. Stephanie Michelle Sanders. Damanjeet Singh. Taylor Jaden Storischuk. Adam Mark Unroe.